a scintillating breaking news about the White House soup of the day. Uh, he was discussing this issue. Uh, you know that Chuck Todd does that every day. He tells us what the White House soup of the day is. It's a big, big feature every morning on MSNBC. Um, so Chuck Todd is on the lawn of the White House, and he still has the soup of the day in his goatee, and he's <laughs> uh, But he, he said, you know, this whole debate in the country, uh, or discussion in the country about holding torturers accountable, is really cable catnip, and, and it's an unimportant issue. And, um, and, and, and about a week or two later, I was on um, HBO with Chuck Todd, on Real Time with Bill Maher. And the panel was me, Chuck Todd, Representative Jan Schakowsky of Illinois, who's on the Intelligence Committee, um, and Jay Leno, you know, the late night talk show host. So uh, the way that that show works is that there's a guest at the top of the show who comes out and they talk for five or seven minutes with Bill about a book or whatever they're selling. And then there's a panel of people, and sometimes it's like a hip hop artist and a tea party person, and you know, there's sort of a mix of people. I'm sure some of you have seen the show. And then they bring out a guest in the middle of the show who either has written a book or has a new show or something like that, and Bill is supposed to talk to them for five minutes, and then the panel resumes. So I was that guest in the middle of the show, and, and a, a paperback version of Blackwater had just come out. And, um, and so they, they, they bring me out onto the stage, and Chuck and Jay Leno and, and, and Jan Schakowsky had already been in this sort of discussion. And, and, and so I sit down, and I'm supposed to, and, they, and they've all been told, when Jeremy comes out here, Bill is going to talk to them for three to five minutes, and you just keep your mouth shut, and then we'll, we'll join the conversation. So we sit down, and Bill is making these jokes about dollar blowjobs with me. Off the bat, I'm thinking my mom is watching this show, <laughs> and my friends are watching the show, and Bill just keeps using the phrase dollar blowjobs because there was this document that had been revealed showing that Blackwater had people on staff and that, that, that people were being paid one dollar to deliver fellatio to Blackwater contractors in the green zone in Iraq. So Bill, of course, being he is, really wanted to talk about that. Finally, I get him past the dollar blowjobs, and we start talking about the substance of the of the book. I didn't get two sentences out before Chuck Todd, you know, the expert of all experts, Mr. Washington Insider, decides he's going to mansplain the conversation to everyone. And, and he says, well, the real thing here, and he starts using his hand like this, and he starts going on. And I, I, just, I just chopped his head off. And I said, wait, wait Chuck, wait, hold on a second. The problem is that none of you people sitting in the front row of the White House do anything to hold this administration accountable. None of you ever ask tough questions, just the way that you didn't do it under President Bush. And I said, and then Chuck's like, what? And I said, what? And I'm sorry. And you called it cable catnip when people were, were asking Obama to keep his word and actually do something to hold the torturers accountable. And, and then sort of this eruption happens on the show. And I didn't think much of it. I mean, this is a you know, late night show. You're doing some sparrings. People do this all the time on their own networks. So we, we get up then to, after the show is done to go off stage. And, um, and we're sitting around, and I'm talking to Jay Leno, which is so strange for me, and, uh, and I know Congresswoman Schakowsky, and um, they're taking our microphones off, and Chuck Todd says to me, that was a really low blow. I said, what was a low blow? He goes, just, just the whole thing tonight, the whole thing that you did tonight. And I said, wait, 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 Chuck, Chuck, I watch you regularly. Just tell me, is, was there anything that I said about you tonight that was inaccurate? And he said, that's not the point. <laughs> <laughs> and he shoves me. Like, physically, actually shoved me. And, and, uh, and said, you sullied my reputation on television. And, and so I'm thinking, you know, do I clock Chuck Todd? <laughs> 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 and, 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 you know, Jay, Jay Leno goes, whoa! <laughs> Congressman Jan Schakowsky goes, Chuck! <laughs> and so standing like this, and I just said, Chuck, you do a good job of sullying your own reputation on television. Uh -huh. and, and we went to this after party, you know, where they were serving the Swedish meatballs. And it was like, Chuck Todd and I were like on some kind of pendulum. I'd go here, Chuck would go here. And it was like, you wanted nothing. But he had these people like petting and coddling. Oh, you were good tonight, Chuck. You were so good on the show. It was unbelievable. These people have such thin skin. They're used to being held up and revered, and they're playing a super soaker at Joe Biden's house in this annual picnic where the journalists are hanging out with the officials and they're all friends and their kids go to school together and their godparents and so-and-so. And then they go to the White House Correspondents' Dinner and they laugh when the president makes jokes about drone striking the Jonas Brothers. And it's all just one big, happy, elitist family of caviar correspondents and powerful politicians. And that's how the, the operation works there. And when someone from outside of their organism ends up in there and says something that you're not supposed to say, they act as though you committed a crime worthy of death. You know, that they can, a grown man can shove another grown man over some shit he said on a television show. And, and to me, that was really revealing. So I, I'm thinking, I am finished. I mean, Chuck Todd is the, I finished on going on MSNBC, Chuck Todd is the news director for NBC. So 
bizarrely, the next week, I get invited to go on a show during the day on MSNBC. So I walk in there, and I sit down to get you know, the makeup put on my face, and the makeup artist says, great job, Chuck. <laughs> <laughs> and, they're, and, they're, and, they're, and they're all sort of saying, you know, oh, we love for that outfit. And then someone, a big way, from the news division, comes in to the newsroom and introduces themselves, if I can do the gender, says who they are, what they do there, and I'm thinking, okay, this is it, they're gonna say to me, please leave the building now. And what they said is, way to stick it to Chuck, it's been a long time coming. And I was like, wow, this is insane, this is people hate Chuck time. <laughs>